all Walmart clippers, or clippers we use at home to cut our hair, there's three basic things that you have to maintain. They're all pretty much the same. Number one, you must maintain tension. What is tension? Tension is the pressure between the comb blade, which is the non-moving blade, and the cutter blade, which is the moving blade. The pressure between the two this way. On top of each other, if the pressure is not tight enough, the hair will go in and just snag and pull and not cut. We're going to teach you how to fix, maintain pressure. Number two, mobility. Mobility is the cutter part of the blade that moves back and forth. If hair, debris, or grime gets in between the blades or in up under the moving tongue of the blade, this will slow the blade down. And then, of course, is lubrication. If you do not lubricate the blade. The blade will not move properly. So we're going to teach you how to use the best lubrication for home clippers is blade boost. It boosts clipper performance. It keeps blades sharper longer. And it brings dull blades back to life. And you can use it on any trimmer or any blade. You order this on Amazon under Blade Boost Clipper Oil. Now, how to maintain proper mobility in your lever to get the best movement. The last thing is sharpness. If this blade's sharpness is dull, the hair will go into the teeth and just snag and pull. We're going to teach you how to maintain the sharpness by using a sharpening block, a magnet, these two pencils to maintain the angle, and the proper paper, 220 grit sandpaper. We're going to conclude with some music by putting this blues back in the barn.